Uh, Julius, this is the JBL 208P portable PA system. Okay, obviously it's designed to be exactly that. We're talking about really, really light. 17.6 kilos with two 8-inch speakers and the mixer. Um, you carried it in here, what do you reckon? Look, it's perfect for your solo artist duo, those, mm. you know, people who don't like lifting heavy stuff. Yeah, yeah. I mean, look, and that's very much where it's aimed. We're talking about that, that Yamaha Stage Pass, Fender Passport, you know, all of that kind of stuff. It's, it's extremely light construction. It's um, 300 watts. You've got two eights with uh, one inch horns. And uh, it's, it's, you know, it sounds, it sounds reasonable. I think the EQ is pretty limiting. I think yeah. that's, um, you know, you've got a, basically a bass and a treble control across your eight channels. The, um, the, the straight flat sound mm. is a little bit lacking top. Yeah. You can put it back in. Mm. Um, look, it is what it is. Mm. And mm. DSP technology now, every year that goes by, mm. if the newer the product, the better the sound. Yeah, I have noticed that. The lighter the weight. Yeah. Um, and it also has reverb. <laughs> <laughs> Far too much in that case, but you know, that's that's just a matter of taste. But yeah, you've got an individual reverb channel. Now, one of the positive things I can say about this is there is actually DSP limiting over yeah. the main bus, which is something you really want in a product like this, which is getting used by people who aren't professional engineers. And we gave it a flogging. We turned it up. Yeah. We turned it up to 11. Yeah. And we shouted at it. Yeah. And, and one and of the it, nice it things about it, it pretty well. Yeah. I mean, one of my personal pet hates in products like this that have automatic limiting over the bus that you can't get to, because you can't, there's no adjustment at all, um, is that, you know, push them a little bit hard and they'll suddenly go into this incredibly aggressive, clipped, nasty badness. They fall apart. Yeah. And where this one was actually, it kept you under yeah. and was quite respectful until you were doing something so remarkably stupid, you, ex you know, you should have gotten a distorted sound out. One of the funnies about this is mm. when we Bluetoothed our phone in, because you've got to play the music. Mm. Um, <laughs> There's no gain control for it. Yeah, but you can do that on your device. You do it on your device. So that was fair enough. Yeah, so you can pair any. But you want to be you want to be aware of what you're doing. You don't want to have this turned up to 11 and then um, yeah. press play. Well, I think you I think you'd do it once and not do it again. <laughs> but um, <laughs> look, the construction's great. Basically, the two speakers clip forward and back. Mm. One hand, off you go. Comes with a little AKG microphone, cables. Yeah. Away you go. Yeah, and that's what it's all about. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for watching the video. If you uh, found it informative, please like us and subscribe and tell your friends.